so hi everyone today we will be talking about a revolutionary tts model which has been released recently and it has taken the entire generative ai space by storm that is kokoro 82 million parameter model which is giving state of the art results in the tts arena so right now it is the ranked one model on tts arena and it has just 82 million parameters which is crazy that means you can run it on your cpu as well inferencing times would be very fast the model is very very small and the results are great so in this particular tutorial first of all i will be teaching you how to run the model for free in google collab or in your local system also and then we will be talking about some of its key features so let's get started so first of all as you can see here you need to run these commands git lfs install clone the kokoro repo as you can see 82 million parameters are there then you need to pip install a software called as espeak hyphen ng i will tell you why and then you need to pip install certain packages like phonomizer torch transformer etc now here you can see that we will be importing build model here and then switching the device to CUDA that means I am using GPU from Google Colab if you are using CPU you don't need to mention this as you can see here now we will be building the model using the path of the model Kokoro v019 as we have git clone the repo in the starting as you can see here and then these are the audio models that are available in the TTS part uh, it doesn't support uh, audio cloning so do remember that it is providing these many options for TTS AF Bella, AF Sara, BF Isabel. So A refers for American and B refers for Britain. So you will be getting the, that particular accent depending upon the speaker you choose. Once done, we would be torch.load voice name dot tensor parts. That is PT and weights only equals to true. So depending upon the voice chosen. So we are going with the first one that is AF and then we will be loading that particular model. Now from Kokoro import generate. This is the text I'm passing it. How could I know? It's an unanswerable question like asking an unborn child if they will lead a good life. Something like this. And then we'll be passing the model text voice pack. Torch.load the voice pack that we have loaded and language equals to voice name zero. Now with this, as you can see, the audio would be getting generated very quickly. And this is the audio that we will generate. Eight seconds. Just listen to the quality of the audio asking an unborn child if they'll lead a good life they haven't even been born how could i know it's an unanswerable question like asking an unborn child if they'll lead a good life they haven't even been born how so as you might have heard the quality is very good and there are no lags no disturbances and given the model size just 82 million parameters and the model is even open source this makes the deal very interesting now let's try to understand certain features of Kokoro and how it is the best model right now for TTS. It doesn't support audio cloning. Do remember this. So as you can see, it is right now ranking at TTS spaces arena hash one and behind it is XTTS. But the, uh, the models that are in its competition are way bigger than it. So hence Kokoro has won the fight for in terms of the model size. Talking about its key features, high efficiency, being very small in size, it still outperforms larger models on rating in TTS benchmarking, low data requirement, trained on less than 100 hours of audio data. This is crazy stuff because when you are training the model on just less than 100 hours of audio data, this is very less to be honest. Include 10 unique voice packs, Bella, Sara, Adam, Michael, Emma, etc. ONX support. For efficient deployment and inferencing it's a framework right now the supported languages are english that is in american and britain and architecture is followed its style tts2 and istft net i'm not jumping into it but it's more of a decoder only architecture talking about the performance as already mentioned it is right now ranking one in the tts space arena and efficiency is very high talking about the usage it's very very easy to integrate and voice selection can be done as mentioned phenom output the model generates 24 kilohertz audio as the quality you might have you has you heard in the example is very very good talking about certain training details uh, this might not be required but just for an ex um, covering it it is trained on a 180 gb gpus for approximately 500 gpus this is still very less costing about 400 dollars this is nothing 
when you are training an LLM. Non-copyrighted audio data is given and trained for less than 20 epochs. The data set on which it is trained is long form reading and narration with no conversational data. So do remember this as well. Certain limitations on the model are no voice cloning is present as mentioned. It is just a TTS, no voice cloning. So I think it's still F5 TTS is the best for uh, open source audio cloning. It depends on eSpeak NG. So you saw that I was doing some sort of installation of eSpeak NG. So it's an external software. It relies on external G2P grapheme to phoneme tools which can introduce failure mode. So if the software fails, this will also fail. I will tell you everything in detail as I have covered it in the last part of the video. Repeated multilingual support, support just American and British accents in English. Not state of the art for all the tasks. So while efficient, it may fail short against larger model. So what is G2P if just giving you a quick brief? It stands for grapheme to phoneme conversation, uh, conversion. It's the process of converting written text into the corresponding phonetic representation. For example, the word cat might be converted to phoneme like K A E T, something like this. It relies on an external G2P to handle the G2P conversion. So for any TTS model, this is an important part that happens. The G2P conversion, it doesn't support itself. So it is using a third party tool. And that is why we were installing that particular eSpeak hyphen NG. Now, how to use Kokoro 82 million? As you saw, I just shared the code in the beginning. You can use that in your local system. Else, even Hugging Face Spaces has Kokoro 82 million. You just go there, try the model out and let us know how you feel about it. Thank you so much.